me up. You are not Mrs. Buchanan. You are a rune. Ah, but you made a pretty good Miss Buchanan and a pretty good job of imitating me, though. So, good job. <gasps> you could be my co-anchor sometimes on Morning News. I, that would be like a great idea. Well, I am Mrs. Buchanan, and today is Tuesday, February 23rd, 2021. Today is Dog Biscuit Appreciation Day, a day to show our dogs how much we love them. So go ahead and give your dog a dog biscuit, or you can make a homemade dog biscuit. <gasps> or, better yet, you could create a video where you're cooking or making your dog biscuit, your homemade dog biscuit, and feeding it to your dog and sending it in for a Sela Junior moment. That would be like a really good idea. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Hi guys, my name's Erwin, and I know that to do Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic in which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, and liberty and justice for all. <laughs> Don't forget to sign up for CMS Eats at Home. Check out our Facebook page or Class Dojo for important information. Or you can sign up at the web address shown on the screen. Congratulations, Emily, on being awarded the Alpha Wolf Award. It was very well deserved. And congratulations, Miss Norris's class, for completing the Empathy Challenge Board. I loved your dance moves. Teachers, keep sending videos in of your classes or videos of yourselves. K. Pi Cecilia is up next. Good morning, Cecilia Wolves. This is Miss Nelson, one of your school counselors. And I know we're only halfway through the month, but Miss Venegas and Miss Ayupon's class have finished their challenge board. Yay! Woo, 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 woo. They did so awesome about learning about empathy during this month of February. And this is not their first time completing it. That was in December. Not their second time completing it. That was in January. But this is their third time completing their challenge board. So that is an extra round of applause. I am so proud of all of the work that you put into during this month of February to complete the Empathy Challenge Board. And now you guys know so much about empathy, which is an important skill. And those skills that you can demonstrate when you are talking with friends or family or just anybody. Empathy is a very important in our life. So I am so glad that you guys took the time to do all of those challenges. Thank you. And Keep other classes, keep out there and working on those challenge boards. And hopefully I will pop into your classroom soon when you have completed it. So good job. Parents, please stay connected to Class Dojo for important announcements and information. Lila Grace, you are an outstanding archer. You had a steady hand and a pinpoint aim. You made a bullseye. Impressive. Keep sending your videos in to Mr. Perez at the address shown on the screen. Now for a Cela Junior moment. doing a water challenge. First, get a bag and fill it up with water. And grab colored pencils. Finally, put the bag on top of your head and poke as many pencils as you can through the bag. I was able to put 13 pencils through the bag. Nine. <laughs> ten. Oh god, we're gonna do like ten minutes now. Eleven. Okay. And I'm dropping. No. No. Thirteen. No. <laughs> Wait, <laughs>
but lack a good leg. I peel layers like onions, but still remain whole. I can be long like a flagpole, yet fit in a hole. What am I? Let me hear your guess. What? 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 <gasps> yes, a snake. You're right. Sizzles like bacon makes a s sound. Yes, they hiss. Good. And they have a backbone, which means your backbone running down your back or like a skeleton, but it has no legs. And they shed skin, which means her skin peels. So the riddle said peels like onions, layers like onions. So, yep, their skin peels. So it was a snake. Good job. Today's riddle, what has lots of bark but no bite? What has lots of bark but no bite? What am I? Good luck. Hasta luego. Goodbye.